Good day guys, this is on from darkrobans.tk or darkrobans.tumblr.com. Today we'll be looking into next page and previous page navigation. This is very useful if you don't want infinite scrolling and in 6.1 we'll be looking at infinite scrolling which I am currently recording as we like speak. So um Let's get into it. So basically, this is the layout. It's just got one picture, and um, yeah, sorry about that. But we got one picture, and basically, we want a page navigation so it goes from one page to the other. So um, basically, how we do this, we have to go into um, just give it a second to change. Yeah, we have to go into advance and make this one. It's just because I don't have any like posts on this so um basically I don't want that many things there okay so because I've only got three pictures on there for this is for the tutorial so if you have that one and we go let's go into coding now so um basically when we click edit HTML there's block post and block photo Please do not try read that. I'll tell you how that works in later tutorials. Um, this is um, basically I'll, I'll, I'll this this right now will be in the like in the description like the link. But let's get coding into it. We just need that sort of renders the photo. So sorry about that, guys. But um, so basically we need to go a block page page navigation basically so let's go block column page navigation it's a weird word that one it doesn't seem right <laughs> and go ending curly bracket there then we go curly bracket block column previous page and then column and basically we're just going to have like a link to go previous so we go a space href equals apostrophe and go column previous page and column so basically that's going to give us our back page and there will be a link in the description saying like like with this like ACI like just like little backward links for us but um I'm just going to use um, an arrow and three dashes just for the tutorial, but I'll put a put some in there just for you. Okay, so um, let's just end that um, that link with um, forward slash and a, and then the closing arrow, of course. So basically, that's the link, and now we have to make it so it closes the block previous page. So um, basically, we press enter and go curly bracket forward slash block column previous page column so it's easy as that and that just adds a previous page to the thing but we want to know what um like page we're on so we're going to go curly curly bracket and go current page it will tell you what page we're on at that current time okay so basically, I'm just going to add like a little line just to say that there is, you know, they're not two numbers bunched together. Then we, at finally, we want our total pages. So we go curly bracket, total pages, curly bracket. And that will give how many total pages we have. So that's very, very easy, guys. Um, so basically, now we want a next page. So we go block curly bracket next page and then curly bracket to end that so basically this is just rendering in our next page button and now we do the the link like we just did with the previous page so we go href equals apostrophe and go column next page column and then the apostrophe and ending arrow then we do the opposite, you know, arrow, so um, three dashes and an arrow, and then close off that link, which is easy, easy. So um, basically, it just needs to be opposite, so it doesn't matter what arrows you use or whatever. And now we're just going to close off block 
um, next page, and I did forget the um, the forward slash, but I will get that just in a second. So um, go curly bracket block and column next page, and then we have to do one for the page navigation. So go block column page navigation and curly brackets, and easy at as it is. It renders in, does it perfectly, so let's save that and let me show you how it worked out. So, and I uh, worked straight away. So it says we're on page one and out of nine. We click that and now we're on page two out of nine. So, um, basically it will have forward slash page forward slash two after your URL, that's what it will do. But basically that's an easy way to get page navigation so please stay in like subscribe so then you can be the first one to see infinite in um, infinite scrolling I hope you like this tutorial on Zizz out